Welcome back. So, Hamlet, our audience has learned that you had a chance to kill Claudius, but that you passed it up. Yeah, that was a stroke of bad luck. He was on his knees praying. And that's not a good time to kill someone. My dad's poor ghost is wandering around at night, and I kill Claudius and send him to heaven? I don't think so. I gotta wait to kill him when he's doing something bad. That'll come soon enough. Well, meanwhile, it's Act 3, Scene 4, and your mother wants to speak with you in her bedroom. You both have some things to say. Let's take a look. He will come straight. Look, you lay home to him. Tell him his pranks have been too broad to bear with, and that your grace has screened and stood between much heat and him. But I'll silence me even here. Look, you be round. I'll warrant you. Fear me not. Draw. I hear him coming. matter. Hamlet, thou hast thy father much offended. Mother, you have my father much offended. Come, come, you answer with an idle tongue. Go, go, you question with a wicked tongue. Why, how now, Hamlet? Oh, what's the matter now? Have you forgot me? By the rouge, not so. You are the queen, your husband's brother's wife, and would it were not so, you are my mother. Nay, then, I'll set those to you that can speak. Come, come, I'll set you down. You shall not budge. You go not till I set you up a glass where you may see the inmost part of you. What wilt thou do? Thou wilt not murder me? Help! Help! Ho! What? Ho! Help! How oh, now? A rat. Dead for a docket. Dead! Ho! I am slain. Oh me, what hast thou done? Nay, I know not. Is it the king? Oh, what a rash and bloody deed is this. Bloody deed. Almost as bad, good mother, as kill a king and marry with his brother. Kill a king? Why, lady, twas my word. Wretched, rash, intruding fool, farewell. I took thee for thy better. Thou findest to be too busy as some danger. Leave ringing of your hands. I think set you down. Enough. Can we send this back to studio? Your heart. Thanks, Sarah. To find out more about Hamlet's meeting with his mother, Gertrude, we have them both in studio with us now. Thanks so much for joining us at what must be a difficult time for you, Your Highness. It's uh, all right. I'm just hoping we can get all this cleared up and back to normal again. Although killing Polonius certainly didn't help. Leave ringing of your hands and let me wring your heart. What have I done that thou darest wag thy tongue in noise so rude against me? Such an act the blurs the grace and blush of modesty, calls virtue hypocrite, takes off the rose from the fair forehead of an innocent love and sets a blister there, makes marriage vows as false as dicer's oaths. What in heaven's name are you talking about? I have a couple of pictures. Ralph, uh, you mind if I show these? And I think, you know, you uh, make, can we show these? Is it sure. Any? This was your husband. He looks like a god. Now look at this. This is your husband. Like a moldy piece of fruit. I shouldn't even put them close to each other. How could you go from this to this? It's not like you're, you're horny. You're too old for that. It's not like some teenager in the back seat of a car trying to get it on Hamlet, with the- please stop. I can't handle this. Perhaps we should take a break. Oh God, I am so ashamed of myself. Well, why do you continue to live in the greasy, sweaty bed with him. Oh, Hamlet, please. You are killing me, please, stop. Claudius is a murderer and a villain. He's not a, a, a 20th of, of uh, a 10th of what dad was, which is, which is like 0.5 percent. He's like, he's like a bad actor that plays a king on TV, which is, oh, sweet angels of mercy. You see, he's mad. My son is mad. Maybe we should take a break. You're here because I haven't done it yet, aren't you? Look, kid, don't get distracted. This visit to your mom is supposed to give you focus. You gotta calm her down. How you doing, Mom? How are you, Hamlet? What are you looking at? At him. At him. Look how he's glaring at me. Don't look at me that way or I'm gonna lose it. Who 
are you talking to, Hamlet? Do you see nothing there? Nothing at all. Yet all that is, I see. No, did you nothing here, Ralph? No, it's just us. Look, uh, and there he goes, just, just how he looked when he was living. Hamlet, it's all in your head. There's nothing there. That's the madness. Madness? I'm, I'm as sane as the two of you. We're not talking about my madness. We're talking about your crimes. Oh, please, Hamlet, you are breaking my heart in two. Good, because it's, it's busted. Throw away the bad part and live the purer with the other half. And do not go to his bed tonight. Act virtuous, even if you're not. I know, I killed Polonius. It sucks. But maybe it was just in the cards. I punished him, and now he's punishing me. I should get rid of the body, shouldn't I? Yes, well, in, in fact, that's what you do next. Well, I need to get to England, remember? Oh, yes. I forgot we decided that. I went to buddies from school. They have to make sure I get there, but uh, they'll be getting theirs. They'll be hoisted with their own petard, you say? Anyway, uh, we should get to bed. You should get to bed. Thanks so much for joining us, Your Highness. Oh, thanks for having me. We'll be back for Act Four right after this. <laughs>